Hey everybody, the Bonga is back. Welcome to part 81 of Let's Play Neo 2. Last episode, I thought it was going to be the finale because there was literally nothing else to do in that game. I did all the Master Dojo missions. I even platinum the game. So you're wondering, like, why are we still here? Well, as I mentioned in the last episode, and I had to put like some text over it, Team Ninja actually released 1.09. On the, this day of like May 15th. This is the day I'm recording this by the way, of course. They not only added a new mode, like a photo mode for instance, which I guess you can only do like in the middle of a battlefield. But they also added a new armor set, which I believe had something to do with them, was it selling a million copies maybe? Or making a million in sales? So they gave you smithing text for a new type of armor. If I can find it, somewhere in the middle, I believe it's called like Million Demon? Yep, there it is. It's right here. And it just does give you like a description, like nothing to say like, hey, we sold a million copies or made a million dollars. The thing is, there's no special effects on this armor, which is very weird. Also a bit disappointing because it's heavy armor. I mean, it has decent toughness and base defense. But it doesn't really offer a lot. As far as armor goes, this is what I got. Level 160 White Bone Spirit Tonfa with plus 8. And I actually got myself two extra Tonfas, Tonfa hair to be able to do like other skills including using Tonfa Gun. And as far as my armor goes, I'm still using the Sohaya Garb set. All of it divine, and a minimum of plus 7. Including an Omomori with all those kinds of stats, including reducing elemental damage, and enemy sensor. And I also have the Yasakani Magatama, that I believe I got from beating the final boss in Dream of the Strong. And it's plus three, so that's actually a really good accessory. So these are like the extra missions we got. Well, not gonna worry about those, because that's not important. These missions actually show up in blue, and they're considered online missions, which I don't know why. I think I'll just do them in Dream of the Samurai on my own time, however. Like, I'll just do them on my own. Because my character is at a really high level, I might as well do them in Dream of the Strong difficulty. By the way, there isn't any missions here. I think it's only chapters 3, 5, and 7. And there are Twilight missions for them too. So yeah, we'll do them in Dream of the Strong difficulty, so that ramps it up. And if you're wondering about my level, I'm at level 238 now. So I'm more than ready for what's coming up, especially with the DLC coming out in, I think, July 30th? That's what I read? So I don't know how true that is. But anyway, there's three missions we can do here. The Chinese Bellflower Dagger, le recommended 164. A Strong Bond, recommended 201. And the Child Prodigy's Invitation, level 175. Oh, kind of thinking of in Dream of the Samurai difficulty, you get a Guardian Spirit for this. But I don't want to do it in Dream of the Samurai, because I'm way over-leveled for that. Why don't we just do it in Dream of the Strong? Chinese Bellflower Dagger. I have heard about the way you fought during the retreat from Kanagasaki. It seems to have really lived up to your reputation. No, no. I didn't bring this up in order to stir trouble. Look, perhaps I should get, just get straight to the point. Since time is precious, I want to face you in combat. I have witnessed your bravery and defiance myself. What's that? Oh, there is no need to fear for my safety. I have already gained Lord Mitsuhide's permission to do battle. Alright, so of course, you know, all these online missions are based on like where you are in the game currently. It doesn't take into account that you've already beaten the main story. Alright, I'm going to give up some Ochoco Cups so I can have a greater chance of Divine Items being dropped. 
So what is this? I face Toshimitsu as a human? Well, at this time, he's not even a yokai. I believe that's what it is. Yeah, see? There he is. Take a power pill. Take a cheap shot. Wait, he, he got up? Oh, okay. He's using Shikigami bombs. Oh, wait, did he just reflect that back at me? Okay, he's actually not messing around. Not too bad. This is actually the first time we're fighting him as a human. I like that. And he's using a lot of Omnial magic. Oh, it will be. Soon enough. Oh, he's still reflecting my projectiles. I thought he wasn't doing that anymore. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, damn. I almost died. Oh, I'm going to have to change up my jutsu again. Well, it's no surprise he's actually using two different elements. Yep, I'm dead. Oh, he really ramped it up at the end. I couldn't kill him. <laughs> That's right, my quick change scrolls have been changed around because I've been trying to grind for titles. Alright, let's try this again. Do not hold back. Okay, this time I'm gonna beat him. Oh, that's a nice combo. I'm gonna break him again. There we go. There we go. Look at that. That's how you bounce back. You fought with honor. I hope we shall have the chance to do battle again someday. Oh, if only you knew. <laughs> nice waving motion there, bro. <laughs> Alright, so like I said, I'll just do these missions on my own in Dream of the Samurai because they're much lower difficulty. So I'll probably end up getting some Guardian Spirits. Although the one with the Guardian Spirit, I might do on screen just to unlock it. In case there's like a cutscene. I did not expect you to wield such power. Now I know why Hideyoshi was so successful. And if you add Spirit Stones to that, well, if you excuse me, I hope our paths cross again. Most likely on the battlefield. Oh, we'll cross paths again. It's too bad you will lose sight of yourself. You know what? I should get Awakening, just in case. I'm not gonna set it, though. What I should set is my Jutsu. And my Shortcuts. Let's see, Barrier is still pretty good. Extraction I'll get rid of, because I'm not going to be using that anymore. Rejuvenation I will need. My own note capacity is not at max yet. I think max with all the passive buffs is 35. And I've only got 32 there. Keep in mind I haven't been leveling it up as much as I should. I should take off the power pills. Go back to quick change. Oh, I have Sneak Thief active, but I don't really use it. So I should have three quick change scrolls. Yeah, that'll do. Yeah, we'll just do that. I'm gonna go back to Rejuvenation because I need to s fix the shortcuts again. 
Yeah, I think that's what we'll do. I don't need spirit stones there. Alright, level 175, 201. That one there looks like it's an actual mission, because it has shrines and everything. The Child Prodigy's Invitation. Hey, there's a message here for you. Here's what it says. In the silver grass I wait, craving a true rival to test my strength. Hmm, his seal. I believe this belongs to Ujisato Gamo, the man Lord Nobunaga's daughter married. I don't know how and when you caught his attention, but this is clearly an invitation. Come now. You wouldn't want to disappoint him, would you? Ujisato? Oh, that's Leon! The one that converted to Christianity! We ran into him in one submission. So he wants to face me in a battle? Yep, I recognize that helmet. He uses the swallow tail. Wow, I didn't think I'd get him in the head there. You can fight. So he likes to use the dual swords. Wow. He got smoked like salmon. And I was so sure of myself. But the way of the warrior is unforgiving. I shall redouble my training and look forward to taking you on again. It is meant to be. Damn, you you actually pretty tall. <laughs> He did not stand a chance. <laughs> Hang on, what did I have on the right shortcut that I normally use? I think it was something that allowed me to, uh... Get a buff? For my weapon? It was either Fire Talisman, or was it... Poison for Ninja? Hitty! You never cease to amaze me! But it seems Lord Ujisato isn't remotely phased by his defeat, and is already talking of facing you again. You've got to admire that kind of determination. I guess that's what it takes to become a general worthy of commanding such an army. That is true. Alright, maybe I can put something else in a shortcut that's consumable. What would be good to use, actually? Probably not a spirit stone. You know what? Maybe we will use a spirit stone. We'll put the large spirit stones here for now. Okay, there's one more mission to do in Chapter 3, and that's a strong bond. Hanbei asked me to pass on a message to you. The truth is, a man by the name of Kuroda Kanbei is currently under suspicion of planning a revolt against Lord Nobunaga. And as a result, the execution of his son... Shujo... Shoujumaru has been called for. Hanbei came up with the idea of using a yokai that can take on a human appearance as a body double to get the young man out of his mess. But then the thing just ran off! Sorry to trouble you, but could you go after it? I can. Okay, it's the Penal Island one. Okay, we've been on this map a few times. Oh, I had a bit of smudge on one of my, uh, analog sticks. Alright, it's gone now. Hope I don't get too rusty at playing this game, because it has been a while. Like, the only time I turned it on was when I got, like, saw on Twitter that Team Ninja updated the game. Somewhat unseemly. But perhaps it is inevitable in one who aspires to unite the land. But then, I wasn't expecting that from Master Hanbei, either. Hi. Oh. Oh, you lived through that. Now, I don't know if the AI got a little bit smarter for this compared to, like, the previous version. And I didn't get a chance to read all the patch notes. Why do I have a feeling that one's gonna get up? I won't give you the chance. 
Hold on, I'm trying to remember, like, what skill was it that allows me to use Tonfa Gun? I think it was one of these? Oh yeah, Crimson Lotus. Follows up a strong attack with a thrust from a single Tonfa. If the Tonfa has Tonfa Gun special effect, pressing square will perform an additional attack that fires an explosive charge at the enemy. Or Devastation, which does the same thing with Triangle. So I need Crimson Lotus and Devastation both for this. I only saw Devastation. Do I have Crimson Lotus on there? Square at end of combo. Where's Crimson Lotus? Oh wait, I'm in the wrong thing. Instead of Heavenly Chain, let's go with Crimson Lotus. I mean, Heavenly Chain does look pretty cool. But I'm going with Crimson Lotus just for the Tonfa gun. Should have done that earlier. Now that I think about it. Hold on, let me climb up that ladder again. Because I did see a guy there. It's probably another sniper. Yeah, look. There! Now I don't have to use only Triangle to get the explosive attack. Now we're cooking with gas. That door does not open. What a shame. The music's a little spooky. I, it's like what they did with Neil 1. Like, they just give you new content for free. It's a good thing I pretty much caught wind of it while it was still very fresh. Whoa! What the hell? You got a quick recovery. Get owned. <laughs> God, the Tonfa gun just has like some raw damage. And it's like fire damage too. So that makes it even better. Well, it's not like there's Kadamas in this level, so we can pretty much just go at our own leisure. Then we'll probably do this level again just for the Guardian Spirit. Oh, you ain't getting the counter on me this time. Not gonna give you a chance. Hello. Nice hat. Hello. You also have a nice hat. Too bad I had to knock it right off your head that you don't have anymore. Will I be playing the Neo 2 DLC? Oh, absolutely. There's like no question. Now, will it be on the day of? I mean, it all depends. What day is July the 30th? Hang on, let me check. It's a good thing I'm doing this off the computer. If it does release on July 30th, that would be a Thursday. And chances are I might be at work by then. So it's very likely I won't be able to do it the day of. Because by the time I get back from work, I'm probably going to end up, you know, it'll probably be around like 5, 4.30 or 5 o'clock. By the time I put on like even the evening upload... I'm not going to have enough time to record this, then render it, and then upload it. There's not going to be enough time. Oh god, now there's lesser umibozus in this part, for real. Oh my god, I even see like a an oni over there. You know what I should have put on the uh, other, like, uh, shortcut menu? Oh, I actually stopped this attack. What I should have put in the other shortcut menu 
Maybe some bombs. There's no reason not to. And it would counter those uh, lesser Umibozus. Come on, what are you going to do about it, huh? Ow! Oh god, he got me two times with that tongue. That is disgusting. Okay, at least we know who's guarding the shrine. We're guarding the Dark Realm. Got him. Hmm. This level may not be too long, then. And you know what? I looked at it when it said, like, online mission. I was like, what? So I have to be online, or I have to have, like, other people with me to play this? And it turns out, no, that's not it at all. So I didn't see that much of a difference. Okay, so over here is where you gotta do photo mode. Take photos of the game using a variety of features. It's a shortcut for this mode from the menu. Hmm, okay. You can adjust the angle and everything, and the camera tilt, exposure, saturation, brightness. You take off blur. Ah, oh, okay. Man, if you really want to make some nice photos and stuff, <laughs> this is what you can do. Display copyright. Oh yeah, you can put your, uh, like, copyright there from the game. Copyright orientation, uh, logo orientation, blah blah blah. <laughs> this will end photo mode. So yeah, if you want to make some really good photos, uh, you can just go ahead and knock yourself out. Find yourself a level with a really nice backdrop and go there. Hello. <coughs> oh, it's you, Hide. You came. That's what she Just said. Be on your guard for yokai who can take human form. Getting a yokai to pretend to be Shojumaru's dead body. That's the only way out of this predicament I can see. There is no way in the world Lord Kanbei would plot a rebellion. Please, Hide. You have to help. The only thing I can think of that can do that is our Rokiro Kubi. There is no... That means I gotta be on the lookout for one of those yokai. Hello. And goodbye. <laughs> I got him out of the way, so no paralysis for me. Let me get up here before I face that Oniudo. Okay, I do see a treasure chest up there, but if I look closely... Yep, that's a Mujina. I can tell by the notches. So there you go. Oh, there's a Kuroka over there. Good night! You don't know how to climb a ladder? Sucks to be you. Bye, Felicia. Oh, I got away. Not anymore. Let me take care of you. At least he won't come back. Oh! Got out of that grab range. That was close. <laughs> Level 185? Yeah, I'll face you. At least you're not another one that just likes to use sloth to kick things off. God, I love that strategy of using that charge attack. Because if you knock him back... Hit them before they get up right away, and you're pretty much guaranteeing a knockdown. And that allows you to get a finishing blow. 
What a great strategy. Just gives you a free finishing blow. I love it. Okay, we're either going up there, which I think leads to a tree I can knock down. Which, of course, leads to the hot spring. Good thing I still remember that layout. Hold on, there's a yokai over there. No, that's a Sohaya! Oh god, and a ninja! No! Oof, yikes. God, I hate those ninjas when they do that. Oh my god, this lighting is not great. <laughs> I can barely see where I can drop <laughs> or walk around. Okay, there's a Yamanba over there. Surprise! Happy birthday! <laughs> In hell! <laughs> Oh. Oh, surprise to me. Okay, looks like this is where I need to go. Wait. A yokai that can take on human form. A Mujina can do that too. That's right. I think I have to look for a Mujina. Mujina. What does the scouter say about his power level? <laughs> so how do I get up there? Unless I'm in the right direction. Wait, that's another tree I can knock down? Really? Okay, before I drop down. Let's try going this way. Oh, you know what? This is the place. Level one. <laughs> Hello. Whoa, 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 whoa. Was not expecting that. Okay, I'm just waiting for these Caltrops to go away. Until they do... He was trying them again. <laughs> you crafty bastard. Ah, so he intends to use it to impersonate Shoju Maru. Well... I can only hope this ends well. Certainly didn't end well for him. <laughs> there, we beat him. Possessed by Mizuchi. Oh, you get it anyway. Alright, so I guess you don't really get a cutscene for that. Mizuchi, I believe, was in the first game. I believe it was like some kind of water snake or something. Thanks to you, we managed to avoid a most unnecessary execution. Lord Nobunaga seems pleased at least. I imagine this whole thing will reaffirm his dominance over his retainers. I shall hide Shojumaru away until such time as Kanbei's innocence is proven. I must pray that I live long enough to see that day. Spoilers, you won't. <laughs> And you almost have to, like, look into here, because if you go into the map, it says that everything's completed, but it's actually not. Okay, and there's nothing in Chapter 4. So, like I said, probably, like, 3, 5, and 7. Oh, check the liveries. And I can look at all these for a Mizuchi. 
Speaking of Mizuchi, let's see what it offers. Okay, it's a Brute Guardian Spirit that gives me Animal Bonus, A- while guarding. Animal Bonus with a Water Attack is increased by B. Increased Defense for Emrita Absorption. Emrita Urn goes up 5%. And Saturation Accumulation on an enemy goes up 20%. Alright, that's pretty cool. But as a Tomb Limit, it's only 20. That isn't very good. I mean, it's not terrible, but... Could be a lot better. Oh, it seems there's only one mission over here. Farewell to the past. I know this is very sudden, but I'm in need of someone who can face a certain man. He was a fellow servant of Buddha, an acquaintance from long ago. I thought that he had long turned to dust, but it would appear that death has not yet taken him completely. Please, do all you can to help him rest in peace. Finally rest in peace. Alright, anything for you, Mitsuhide. Okay, so this is like the ancient temple level. We've been here before, too. I don't think this introduced like a new map or anything that hasn't been used in Neo 2 yet. Probably won't see anything like that until the DLC. You want some of this, too? Of course you don't. Oh great, Omnio Mages. Oh great, Omnio Mages! <laughs> Where are you guys dropping from, anyway? Oh, a smithing text for a white fox mask. I thought I still had something like that. Alright, how many more do I have to face? Oh god. I notice I have confusion already on me. What the hell? I gotta wait for that to expire. So I don't take, like, extra damage. Jesus! Why don't you go 100% of the way, then? Right now I'm saturated. So I see his game, like using like a fire barrier, inflicting me with different elemental damage like lightning or ice. And then if I try to get up close, I will get confused. All right, now I close the distance. This might be my chance. He has, like, faster casting, too, I noticed. But he's almost dead. Got him! Okay, so they're not really boss characters, but they certainly have, like, greater move set. So that's definitely something to watch out for. I like that. It offers more of a challenge. I give it that. And that's what I like. Alright, so let's continue on there. I think there's none in chapter 6, but I'm gonna double check. You have my gratitude. Through your deeds, he can finally pass on to the next life. If, Toki if Tokichiro fell at Kanagasaki, then perhaps things would be... No, no. It is already too late for such words. 
That sword is now in need of a master. If it calls to you, then it is yours to wield. Eh? I will definitely... Hold on to it! Too bad I didn't get a smithing text for it. I would have preferred that. Okay, there's definitely nothing new here. So we're gonna have to go to Afterglow. And there's three missions, no, four missions here! Ooh, okay, we could be here a while. Yeah, do I have enough to level? Close. So I should probably use one of those items now. Lumicide Crystal? I'll use five of them. That should be enough. I'll probably save the Ember Sight for, like, much later in the game, when I'm gonna need a lot more Emerita. Alright, put another point in Courage, because remember that I do use Tonfas. And they are gonna be, like, my... Like, my best weapon for a long, long time. Ooh, new deliveries. Extra glory. Thanks. Alright, let's see what we got here. Wave of Terror, level 219. Winds of Ruin, level 215. The Trustworthy, level 218. And Calamity's Pulse, level 220. That's even higher than the final boss level. Well then. Actually, three of these missions are higher than the final boss level. Alright, so let me stop here, and then the next part we can do these four missions. Hopefully I'll be able to do all four of these missions. But I think they included Twilight missions too. So who knows, maybe this, uh, this last part of the Let's Play could have like, three episodes or four? Who knows? See you there everyone, thanks for watching.